everybody. Thanks for stopping in. When I was shopping at the Dollar Tree dollar store the other day, I happened to see this packet of onion soup mix. You get three packets for a dollar, and there's a recipe on the back for roasted oven potatoes. I tried that out the other day, and it was good, so we're going to do that one. Let's get toasting. I'm using russet potatoes for this because it's what I have, and here's the way I'm slicing them up. Just uh, kind of small pieces. You can cut them any way you like. And I always leave the peelings on my potatoes because I like the peelings plus all the vitamins are in the peelings. So um, we get, I'm going to cut up four or five of these like this and then we'll be back. I already washed my potatoes but I'm going to rinse them off again now because it kind of gets, doing this kind of gets some of the excess starch out of them. You don't have to do this but I kind of like doing this. I'm going to use an 8x8 glass baking dish for this. You could use a toaster oven tray as well, but mine's starting to get kind of ratty looking, so I just use this dish instead. Now all you do is dump a package of this onion soup mix in there. Just kind of sprinkle it around. And, uh, and it says one third cup of olive oil. That seems like a lot of oil though, so I'm just going to kind of eyeball this. If you don't have olive oil, you could probably use any kind of cooking oil. Now I'm just going to get it all good and mixed up with my hands. There you go for the people that get grossed out by me using my hands. I washed them. They're clean. It's the easiest way to mix things. I set my oven to bake at 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Now we'll just get these in there and they'll probably take about 45 minutes and I might have to stir them up once or twice while the potatoes are cooking I was just looking at the label on this box no gluten no MSG no trans fat no artificial colors or flavors that's pretty good for something coming from the dollar store it's been about 40 minutes and I did stir these up twice I think they're probably done I'm gonna get them out of there well, there's how they look when they're all done. I put a little bit of sour cream and green onion on top just to give it a little bit of color. But these are easy to make. They're inexpensive. They're a great side dish for meat or fish. Or I had some leftover ones for breakfast with a couple eggs the other morning. So there's a lot you can do with these. Thanks for watching, you guys, and I'll talk to you next time.